What it do YouTube, it's your boy Midi and today I'm gonna show y'all how to create my perimeter lockdown. I'm gonna do an update on my previous build video. So as you can see, here's my perimeter lock. I'm just gonna show you how I made it. Okay, my name is Easy Reed. I made it on a point guard position. A right-handed jersey number, it doesn't even matter, but for the sake of the video, I'm gonna do it exactly the same as, as I did it on the first one. Number nine. Okay, for the pie chart, pick the red and green one. The red and green one. Shooting and defending. Physical profile. I chose this one with the most speed. So if you want to create my exact build, pick this one, but you can go. Um, Let's say the balanced one is also good because you get a lot of vertical and speed. It's, you don't need strength. The vertical is pretty high anyway, but if you want the extra vertical, go for the balanced one. If you want the extra speed, go for the one with the most speed. I'm gonna go this one though. Okay, for the attributes. I filled up everything. Hold on. 77 post fade. You see, if I go down one, I get one less batch, but you need to go maximum batch on this one. So everything to the max. And the defense as well. 2K brought out a patch where they give you less block. My block on my perimeter lock is like an 80 something. But they patched it so it only becomes a 66 but it doesn't matter just go for the max block put the remaining ones in driving layup driving dunk and close shot that's what i did i didn't care about playmaking at all why because i'm playing the two or either the three and the four in rec and the two on twos. I don't play much threes, but if I play threes, I play the three, I play the big. So I'm I'm not dribbling the ball anyways. I'm only rebounding, playing defense and spotting up in the corner. Okay, so this is the attributes. I went for the, not slide, but compact. It just seems more natural to me. And the height is 6'6". Weight, lightest weight, 180 pounds. Go for the lightest weight. And go for the, go for this wing spent. You see that the three goes down to a 77. That's what you want it to be. Otherwise it will be a two way sharpshooter. You want it to be a perimeter lockdown. And you can pick between these takeovers. I picked the lockdown one, but after playing the playing the game for over half a year, I don't regret it, but I'd rather have this one, but it's up to you, it's personal preference. I went for this one. And that's how you do it, guys. You just built my perimeter lockdown. Simple as that. But I'm gonna show you the badges I use before I end the video. All right, we're gonna test the build at a 99 overall. For the finishing badges, I went slithery on silver. Oh my God. On gold and fancy on gold. This is all you need. All you're gonna do is half step in through the paint. That's the only thing you need to do. Okay, for shooting, this is gonna be a weird setup, not gonna, not what you used to see. 
but I use Hall of Fame catch, Hall of Fame range, gold quick draw, silver green, silver clutch, and gold dead eye. This is what I use. I'm not using Hudson Hunter at all. I think Clutch Shooter is a better batch on twos. Not in rec, but on twos. Because if either your team or the op opponent's team gets 15 points, this batch will start working. It's a huge comeback batch. I'm gonna explain it in a different video, but I use Clutch Shooter over Hudson Hunter. So this is my batch setup on shooting. Playmaking doesn't even matter, you can use Dimer, but I use Quick First Step just in case I have to ISO a center who can play defense. I use Quick First Step. Okay, defense. Holly Pickpocket, Holly Intimidator, Holly Interceptor. Bronze Box because it helps on the, on helps on boxing out on the big guys. Hall of Fame Rim. Hall of Fame clamps and silver chaser. This is what I use. You can go gold pickpocket and gold chaser if you want to, but this is to my playstyle, so this is what I use. I don't use big dodge because I'm guarding bigs. No brick wall because I play with guards who play ISO, so I don't need to set screens yeah this is it if I play 1v1 in the stage and I use interceptor I use pogo stick I only change this if I play 1v1 in the stage or rush 1v1 I use these badges My interceptor is a go to batch, so I gotta have that on Hall of Fame. Okay, this is the batch setup. The jump shot I use, if you really wanna know that, oh, it's not even it's not even listed here. But I use Ben Simmons, guys, Ben Simmons. If you see me using another jump shot, it's Lance Stevenson. Lance Stevenson and Ben Simmons. I see Lance Stevenson. Ben Simmons is not listed here. It, I use this since the beginning of the year. It's been a pretty good jump shot for me. You've probably seen it in my other videos. But yeah, this is it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys learned something, if you guys are planning on creating this build, drop a like on the video and subscribe for more mixtapes. They're coming up, I swear. And see you guys next time. Bye!